We never had a, in the last five years, a single MS patient, a single ALS patient, a single Parkinson's patient who did not test positive for Borrelia burgdorferi. Not a single one. About three years ago, I became ill with the disease that was ultimately thought to be ALS or Lou Gehrig disease and had prepared to die within about two years' time. My neurologist tells me that I was progressing so rapidly that without the diagnosis of Lyme disease and antibiotics, I would have continued to decline losing strength, eventually becoming bedbound, eventually unable to talk or swallow or breathe, and would have died in a matter of a couple of years, just like anybody else with ALS. So I was started on high doses of intravenous antibiotics, only to see what would happen with no guarantees. To our amazement, within a month, my energy improved, so instead of being exhausted in an hour, I could be up and about and active for four or five hours. We're now two years out, and I find that if I go off of the antibiotics, I lose stamina and I'm not yet back to my full self. But the change is absolutely dramatic. <laughs> 